Good evening, everyone. I'm Archit Sashadri. Today is Tuesday, July the 5th. This is We On. Let's take a look at your top stories this hour. The standoff between Maldivian President Abdullah Yamin and former President Gayoon reaches a flashpoint. Foreign Minister Dunya Mamoun resigns just hours after her brother Farish is expelled from the ruling PPM, increasing the president's isolation within his own party. Expelled Maldivian ruling party leader Farish Mamoun tells Wian the country faces an alarming situation, even as the opposition party, the MDP, says it won't rule out supporting a splinter group led by former president Gayu. Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi has inducted 19 new faces to his Council of Ministers. The reshuffle comes at a crucial time when key states prepare for elections. Meanwhile, five junior ministers resigned from the federal ministry. News on the Saudi Arabia bombings. Saudi officials have identified a Pakistani national as Abdullah Gulzar Khan as the Jeddah suicide bomber. He had attempted to detonate a device just outside the U.S. consulate in Jeddah. The bombing there was among three suicide attacks in Saudi Arabia this Monday. European Union criticizes George Osborne's proposal to slash corporate tax by 15%. The EU fears it could lead to a series of competitive tax cuts. The proposal from Britain's Chancellor of the Exchequer comes amid fears of a corporate exodus following the Brexit vote. And NASA's Juno spacecraft enters into Jupiter's orbit. The spacecraft will now begin a 20-month journey around the solar system's largest planet or learn how the planet was formed. And that is our bulletin for right now. We'll keep you updated from Breaking news from across the globe, just check our digital, mobile and social media platforms. Thanks again for joining us. Have a great day.